everyone, how you're doing? Hope you're all doing fantastically well. So today I'm going to run through with you of um, the countries that I'm visiting for arrival uh, cards and uh, visas if your country requires a visa. So I'm going to show you online of uh, what is required so that if you're going to either Vietnam, to Singapore or to Malaysia if you need a visa or not or how to obtain an arrival card so let's get onto my desktop and uh, let's check out what is required for you guys to know before you arrive in either of the countries I've just mentioned so for any of you who want to go to Vietnam and uh, you want to obtain uh, an arrival card well if you're going to Vietnam you'll need uh, an M3 form now most airlines will give you this on the plane anyway uh, I've struggled to find a digital version of the app but if you want to fill this in before you arrive there then this is what will be required to fill in before you arrive in Vietnam so if you want to save time and you want to fill this form in then this will be very very useful for you and if you need a visa then there's a list of countries here that will uh, tell you if you require a visa before you arrive in uh, Vietnam so for the UK example if we scroll down you don't require a visa you'll get 45 days which is really really good but if you're from the US uh, you require a visa which says it right here and for you Aussies you will require a visa there too so just look at the list here if you require a visa on arrival if you're planning a trip to Vietnam I'll leave all the links in the description box so you can have a look yourself and uh, do your own due diligence before applying for a visa or not before you enter Vietnam. For any of you who are wanting to go to Singapore, uh, you can apply for a health decoration arrival card and uh, you'll be required to fill this in three days prior to you arriving in Singapore. So you can uh, download the app and uh, you just go here, download it from Apple Store if you've got an iPhone or from Google Play. Very easy to fill in. And then you'll get like a QR code. So when you arrive in Singapore, it's very easy for you to go through the e-gates when you arrive in Singapore. So that is the app right there if you want to download it. Very easy to do. No problems there at all. And for countries, that do require visa or don't uh, there's a list here of countries of uh, how many days you'll get in Singapore or whether you require visa or not so for the UK you'll get 90 days and if you're from the US you'll get 90 days at two and for Australia you also get 90 days there as well so pretty good uh, which you get a longer days and uh, countries that are not listed here you will require a visa but down here we'll tell you of the countries that do require visa so if you're from these countries here then you will require a visa visa required for China Georgia Kazakhstan Pakistan etc so if it's in the red box then those countries will require visa so if you're planning to go to Malaysia then you'll need to fill this in before you arrive so you got to fill this in three days prior to you arriving in Malaysia and it's called a, a MADAC MADAC Arrival card, MDAC, and uh, if we click off here, 
you click on register and you just fill in your information here and then you'll get your digital arrival card for Malaysia. Here is a list of countries of visas not required and required for entry into Malaysia. So for Australians, you will get 90 days. For the UK, you get 90 days. And for the US, you'll get 90 days there as well. So that's just a list of countries, of requirements and arrival cards before you enter those countries. I hope you find that video particularly useful on arrival cards and visa requirements for entering Vietnam, Singapore and Malaysia. I'll leave all the information down in the description box so that you can click on the link and uh, check out more information if you require that information to enter those countries I've just mentioned. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks a lot for watching. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. It doesn't cost anything and it motivates me to do more videos like this so that I can be more helpful to help you guys for useful information and my travels. So I'll be going on my way to Hanoi in the next video, flying with Kataweris, and uh, hope to see you guys in the next one.